If you'd like to see how I'm going to take these pre-made iron-on transfers and put them onto some blank shirts to create these lovely, vibrant, beautiful t-shirts I made for myself and my daughters, keep watching this video. Hey YouTube. So today in this video, I am going to be using these iron-on transfers that I purchased from AliExpress.com. And I'm going to be using these on these blank shirts. I have these blank shirts that I purchased from Forever 21. Um, one of them is from Target. And then I have a blank shirt that I purchased from maybe Walmart or something for my daughter. I made it, I pressed on these shirts earlier, but I didn't record it. So I found some extra shirts I had. So I'm like, let me just go ahead and record it since I have so many left over. I'm gonna show you an example. So the shirt was blank, this color, which is not too dark, not too light. But just to show you that these work very well on light and dark color shirts. They were from AliExpress.com and they were about three bucks a piece. Maybe the kitty ones were like two dollars a piece, but they were like um, two dollars for the transfer and one dollar for the shipping. Some of them were free shipping. Look at this. This looks like something you would buy from the store. Just a regular plain shirt. I did use my heat press. I put it on 300 and I pressed it for about 15 seconds, but I feel like you could also use an iron if you don't have a heat press. So if you do use an iron, um, I would cover the transfer maybe with something, uh, maybe a pillowcase with the iron first, just in case anything gets messed up. I would also cut off the um, steam. But yeah, this is like super cute. I just love this. It says cute, smart, and a little bit dramatic. And this shirt is like perfect for my two-year-old daughter. And let me show you another one that I made for her. This shirt slightly fits different. It's like that athletic youth type of shirt where it's more wider. But look, very, very cute. And let's see, I'll show you this other one. I don't know why the shirt got so wrinkly. Um, but look at this one. I really like this. And by it being chilly outside, um, now I want to go ahead and order me some um, blank, either like hoodies or pullover um, sweatshirts. That'd be super cute with these on. I'm gonna order some more. They even have them for like Christmas themed. But remember, with AliExpress, it is a China-based um, company. And sometimes the shipping, they've gotten better over the years, but Sometimes it could take two to three weeks or more to receive your items, but they've gotten better. It used to be like two or three months. And then this is a shirt I made for myself. I would prefer if it was like a crew neck and not the V-neck, but I think this is cute on this red. So let's go ahead and get started. I already have my heat press set. So I'm gonna have to um, take my setup down to where my heat press is located. So I only have, let's see, I only have four shirts. So before I go down, I wanna just kinda pinpoint what shirt is gonna get what on it. I don't think I wanna do that. I don't think I wanna do that one. I feel like I want to do this yellow on yellow. I don't know, she's wearing a yellow shirt. The shirt is yellow. I kind of like that with the purple, but I just want to see how it looks on the white. So I'll just kind of play it back and forth to see which one I like better between the white and the yellow. Cause I have two yellow shirts and one white. The pink shirt is for my daughter. And the only girly one, let me just do hers first. There's only one girly kitty one here. And that's this. And this looks super cute. It's really big. I was just gonna fill up the whole shirt. That's really cute. And if I wanted to be extra, I could fill this in with some rhinestones. I'm not gonna do that. Or I could blink out her glasses. I'm not gonna do it. I may in the future, but this is just cute enough right here. And then if you wanted to, you could add your daughter's name to it. If you wanna be extra jazzy about it. But yeah, so that's the only girly one I have left. So that's gonna be on there. So here I was basically just trying to match up the shirts to the transfers to see what color I wanted it to be on and which ones I want to save for later for when I get hoodies or just maybe different color shirts. So I really like these. I'm going to save those for a hoodie and I ended up going with the lion and the other two. Well, you'll see what I chose, but 
I was like, I have so many transfers to choose from with just a couple shirts, but it's okay, I'll get more shirts. So I have my heat press set to 333, and I have the shirt on here. I'm just gonna give it a quick couple second press to get out any moisture, if there's any moisture there. Now, I am going to be putting on the transfer, which is a very nice size. Line that up, really cute. Maybe I can move it up a little bit right there. Then I have my Teflon sheet here. And then I'm just gonna press. Okay. That's all pressed on. I'm gonna take it upstairs and pull it everything off. I'm just gonna do the same with the rest of the shirts. Just make sure you take the time to line your shirt up so nothing isn't like lopsided or crooked. This doesn't take long at all. And again, use an iron if you don't have a heat press. Don't let that discourage you. Okay, so I'm back from the heat press machine and I just wanna show you how the shirts turn out. Very simple, quick, straight to the point video. Um, and the cool thing about this, you don't have to worry about weeding anything out or having a cutter. This is something you just buy, you press it on, you go about your day. And it's not hard to pull off. Like um, when you're weeding something out and it's real sticky, you gotta pull it off hard and hold the shirt down and pull, no. Now I haven't used it and washed it yet, so we'll see how that goes, but this is very pretty, like something from the store. And the thing about this, this actually looks like, you know, more like my daughter than what's in the store. They are getting better with putting um, brown people on shirts, but just cute. Okay, so we'll sit that one to the side. So I'm just gonna go ahead and peel this one off. Nice and smooth. Love that. Love it, love it, love it. Very pretty. And this Forever 21 shirt was like, do it say it on here? Look at this, $4.99. So something in a store like this, I guess depending on where you go, it can be up to like maybe $20. I don't know, it depends on where you go, but if the shirt was five bucks, the transfer was $3, it's like an $8 cute shirt. You know, I think it's cute. So we can sit this one to the side. And if you wanna have a business and buy blank shirts wholesale and buy these, maybe see if you can get them wholesale, that's an idea too. I'm sure people are doing that. I'm just gonna go ahead and continue to peel these off. Let me know what you guys think. Which one do you think is, what is your favorite one? I can't wait to make these with some hoodies. And then of course, like I said, if you want to really get jazzy with it, add some wording on here if you want to. I love colorful stuff. So this is like, and then the fact that it's a lion is like, wow. Let me just show you, this is probably gonna be a different, this is gonna be a different video, but let me just show you what I did. Sneak peek of my next video, I guess. So look at this. I had a big one like this, I thought, but you can get a miniature one. I bought smaller ones because I thought they were gonna be bigger. I thought they were gonna be like this size for the adult and then like maybe a little bit smaller. I didn't think the miniature ones that go like on a onesie or for a smaller child shirt would be this little. So I was like, you know what? Let me cut out some denim, some old jeans. I can use these as patches. I didn't, that's why I didn't peel these off yet. It's gonna be for a different video. These are going to be patches that I can put on some Crocs. You know, something different. Just trying to think outside the box, y'all. Okay, so that's it for this. Okay, you guys, here is the final finished result of the shirts. They're so bright, they're so pretty, they're so vibrant. Like, it looks like I went to the store and bought these shirts but I used the pre-made iron-on transfers I told you about that I got off AliExpress. You can just download the app. Again, it may take a week or two for them to come. They've gotten better, but look, 
just an update. I did look on Amazon to see if they had these because you know Amazon stuff coming about two days if you have Prime and maybe about five days if you don't. They have these transfers on Amazon also. I bought some. I bought like five and it was $10. So it's kind of about the same price. But the only thing is they didn't have as many to choose from as there is on AliExpress. But if you want to find these on Amazon, I will have a link so you can see where you can purchase these. They have like some Christmas themed ones. They just have a lot to choose from. But thanks you guys for watching this video. I hope you did find it helpful. Um, I'm almost at 20,000 subscribers and I'm very excited about that. So hello to all my new subscribers. Hello to all of my subscribers. And give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and share it on Facebook if you can. And thanks again for watching you guys. Bye bye. Check out our website, myworldradiance.com, and we do carry faux leather inspired designer fabric for your crafting needs, luxury inspired croc charms, as well as iron on patches, and much more. Enjoy the coupon code MYROYALBEAUTY10 off. Check out our website, CRTacticalDefense.com, where we do sell in waistband gun holsters, belly band holsters, and many more. Please check out my discount code VIBES for a special discount for my subscribers.